Here's a little trick to help you correct some of your bad tennis habits uh, using uh, YouTube videos. In my case, I'm learning the two-hand backhand, and I found this uh, really clear slow motion shot of Thomas Burditch um, practicing his two-hand backhand. And what I do is when I go to the court, I set up a camera on the baseline, and I make sure to film for at least 15 to 20 minutes. And when I get home, I compare uh, how my backhand is coming along uh, to this slow motion version of, of Burditch. So I can see here that my prep is pretty good. But as I strike the ball, there's a real obvious flaw here in that I'm, I'm crossing my feet over and also uh, I don't have this wide stance that I see from Burditch. And that's not something that I, I can sense out on the court. The balls are going in, everything feels good, but, but when I check the video I can see and compare to Burditch uh, all the things that, uh, that I need to fine tune. So uh, it's a lot of fun to uh, watch all the, the videos of the pros that just didn't exist before YouTube. We can kind of see the, the secrets of their success up here. But if you want to get uh, the full benefit um, of slow motion video analysis, you really got to do a side by side comparison of, of your strokes to, uh, to a, a technically perfect stroke.